theme, and this is part of a series of educational articles about the curing, uh, the inspection for the Frisian horses. And uh, what I wanted to do was kind of talk a little bit about confirmation today. And then after that, we'll talk about um, some movement. I'm not a, a judge or a trainer, and I'm just kind of relaying information that I have learned over the time. So I, can, I encourage you to go to clinics with inspectors and learn much more detail. But anyway, this document here uh, talks about uh, the linear. This is a copy of the linear score sheet. This one's a little bit old. Uh, this is from 2007. I say here there's been a change in 2010. I believe balance was added to movement. But basically, the judges are scoring the horses in these different categories, head, head and connection, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And this is one end of the spectrum, so head's plain or it's noble. It's heavy or it's light, et cetera. Um, left and right is not necessarily good or bad. Uh, they're really looking for things where it's shaded, so you can see areas where it's shaded. And a lot of times it is shaded on the right, but say in this case, it's shaded on the left. And right down the middle is the breed standard. So a horse can be, you know, above or to the right or to the left of the breed standard on any particular area. These are groupings that turn around and uh, become down here. So, for example, uh, these are the scores that end up mattering. And where they get the scores from is the individual characteristics they see. So the type, and there's a type down here too. And they'll look at all those things and they end up giving scores down here. And that's what turns out to give you the score for the horse. It's sort of the look of this whole picture. Now, uh, what I tried, uh, I was kind of debating the best way to explain this and show you, and I thought maybe by sample horses. So I actually have two that are two good mares, but very different mares. They, they do happen to have the same father, but other than that, they are not at all alike. And I want to show you a little bit more about them. So was, again, I'll do that throughout this educational series, but I'll start with, uh, with confirmation. By the way, these are my mares, and it just the reason I picked them is because, A, they're not perfect, and which is like most people's horses. And uh, B, I happen to have the uh, I happen to have video and scores for them. So anyway, hopefully you'll be understanding about that. So let's start with one. This one is a more recent video. This is from 2009, and uh, let's look at the confirmation of this mare. Okay, and you can see she's a little um, she's fit, good shape, nicely muscled. Neck's a little short. The front legs are good bit short. And this mare is from an older line, more of a Baroque harness type line. And uh, pretty straight in the front, but you can see from the back here she has a little towing out there. There you can really see it from this angle, which is one reason why the judges look at them from the rear. They're trying to check uh, you know, cow hawk, sickle hawk, etc. She's not standing very still for them, but Nevertheless, now this is the chief inspector. This is a, one of the judges. The chief inspector is looking, and right about here, he shakes his head a little bit. And I have a feeling he was looking at that <laughs> foot, but I don't know. And she goes off to, uh, of course, they, they saw her coming in as well, but here she was standing. Now let's look at a different mare. Um, this is an older video um, from 2003, and they did judge them slightly differently then. So let's look at her. Pretty mare, tall. She's got a really nice top line here. This connection is really good. So very strong mare. Um, she happens to be very black, not that that necessarily matters. But you can see she has a longer neck, slightly curved, more upright. Still a little bit short in front legs there, but uh, not so much for a Frisian. And she takes off and starts walking. So. Uh, and this happened to be a chief inspector here, uh, Louise Humpa, the only woman I know that's an inspector. Anyway, so how did they score? Well, if we look at their scores, the first mare here, um, they were checking on her confirmation, her type, you know, how the racial type, her frame, and about her legs, and. She had a couple of fairly low scores here. It's funny, they say her hooves are small. Hmm, I wonder about that. They said her shoulder is too steep. You know, with a steep shoulder, they're, they're going to think that she probably cannot have room in, us in the in the walk or the trot because she just can't reach out with a steep shoulder. This is characteristic of an older type uh, build of a horse. 
Um, again, there's a lot that she had here uh, that were standard, and a few she had over here that kind of fell out. Um, her neck's a little horizontal, downhill, and just kind of a little bit below average in these things. Now, if we look at Corey's, if we look at the other one, this is the older mirror, and you'll notice this is uh, this is an older. This is from 2003. Oops. Okay. Now this one happens to be in Dutch, but I'll translate it as best I can for you. Now one thing I want you to notice is there's not as many lines here as there are here, regardless of the language. That's because the what they're judging the horses on has changed. So they judge them on more things now you know, than they used to. But if I look through, now her scores were a bit better. So um, they liked her confirmation more. So this kind of goes along here with the head, head neck connection. Um, this is her neck, and you can see that she has a more vertical neck. They liked her head. They thought her head was more noble. Uh, the shoulder, they thought her shoulder was more sloping, so they would expect a little bit better movement from her, just based on purely on the uh, geometry of her body. Those things we're doing here, and then... Here she got a really good score for the length of her form, which is something they want to see because that's now translated into being built uphill or built downhill. That's something that was not on this form explicitly back in 2003, but it is now. So it's right here. So um, anyway, overall, her, her definitely her scores in this area were better than this mare's scores. So you would expect uh, the, the one on the right to have gotten... Um, better scores with regards to racial type and frame and legs probably than than this one got okay uh and we'll look uh, to movement later